What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Sea of Thieves, episode number 30. Oh my goodness. 30 episodes of Sea of Thieves dating all the way back to the very beginnings of this game in 2018, I think. Uh, sounds right, but I'm not 100% sure. So go watch me play that for like four hours in uh, part number one. Uh, but now, a days, hello. Hey, Nowadays, uploading this. Hey, will you not startle me like that, please? Um, nowadays, this series is uploading on Thursdays, uh, right here on youtube.com slash Rex. So please, if you want to see more, scroll down, subscribe, ring that bell. That way you are notified when I post new videos at 6 a.m. and 7 p.m. every single freaking day because I am a madman. Uh, thank you so much again for helping me hit 900 subscribers. Feels great. Now we can push towards 1,000 and maybe I'll shut up about it. I won't, but... There's hope. Just like the hope of the buried treasure we hope to find today. I don't know how to tie that back to Sea of Thieves. Uh, today, we don't have much of a plan. Episode number 29, bit of a disappointment. A positive is that we took down a skeleton ship. The negative was that the current adventure that is running requires at least five players to uh, defeat the final boss piece of it. Shout out to the boon. Um... And that sucks. Shout out to what? What boat? It's a sleep? Oh, a sloop. Oh, okay. I guess there's a boat in front of us already. Well, I'm trying to do an intro. I'll yell at them. I'll get my little megaphone and be like, I'm doing an intro for a YouTube video. Please, go away. Um, but yeah, last week, uh, disappointing because five people to do that final part kind of sucks. Um, uh, so yeah, here's the plan today. We're going to kind of just sail the seas and see what happens. We're going to test their emergent storytelling. Not really, but you get the idea. Just kind of go out and see very, what happens. Now, thing. let's see. We're going to browse her stock real quick. A while ago, or maybe in a future video, I don't really know. The Legend of the Sunken Kingdom. This is a quest that's been locked for a while. Now, in order to unlock this, you have to unlock a specific commendation, the Mysteries of the Sunken so Kingdom, that commendation. How you unlock that is you go over here to this reputation. I think it's Bilge Rats, the Sunken Kingdom. And what you want to do is you want to discover the thing. Something. Where is it? Legend of the Sunken Sorrow. Was it the Mysteries of the Sunken Kingdom? I've already forgotten what it is. Hold on. Hang What's on. on the horizon today? Let's go back here. It's a cool quest that I want to try. Um, and we're going to do that. The Mysteries of the Sunken Kingdom Commendation. Hang on. Which is actually an achievement. The Mysteries... Uh, mystery of... The Sunken Kingdom. Oh, you absolute turd. Adventure quest. Uh, hold on. Hold on. We're going to find it. It's everybody's favorite part of the video. Mysteries of the Sunken Kingdom. Got to look at it. There it is. Mysteries of the Sunken Kingdom. Uncover secrets throughout the Sunken Kingdom. The five of 30. The Five of 30 refers to these... Mysteries of the specific areas that we need to go to. And this is where you find books. Uh, in a previous episode where we had four people on it, um, we actually, I actually unlocked one of these uh, shrine things and got an achievement for it. So we're going to just kind of see whichever one's closest. I'm going to pull up a guide and we'll kind of, I'll at least try to find the books and see if we can make some uh, some progress towards that maybe we'll get distracted and see what happens um yeah we kind of came up with a couple of like pretty simple ideas for this one and we'll see uh we'll see what uh, what sticks i did see another big boat kind of just ignore us oh that's a pirate boat yeah. could go ruin their day uh actually let's see treasury of the secret wilds did you look at the map? 
Oh, okay. I just thought it was in a weird spot. The Shrine of Hungering is just to the north of us. It looks like what there? Two big boats out there? I can't tell if they're both skeleton boats or not, but there's two big boats out there. I see one skeleton. Where's the other? Are they both in the same kind of direction? Is that just one boat? The way it was turning towards that island, it looked like it was multiple boats. So maybe it's just one that just looked funny to me. That was a weird musical cue. Popped in my headphones. Yeah, it's just one boat. Okay, good. Excellent. One crew member already going crazy. That's fantastic. Uh, but we're going to go up. I know. The Shrine of Hungering. We're going to go to the north and check out what is up there. I kind of doubt we'll be sailing with the wind, but hey, uh, of course we aren't. Just throw that out there. Get that up at least. Hang on one second before you drop that. Oh, just kidding. We don't actually want to do that one because that's the only one I have the achievement in, which means I've already found all those books. So we'll actually just go with the wind and we'll, we will go. We will go to the Shrine of Flooded Embrace, which is just a little bit. We need to move the boat just a little bit to the left. Uh, feel free to drop the sails. But we'll sail with the wind and we'll go kind of southwest-ish here and uh, we'll go over there and see what uh, see what happens it's a good thing I looked at that because it's <laughs> there's six of them uh, and I picked the one that I had already uh, kind of figured out so that's good <sighs> anyway thanks for watching thanks for hanging out Hopefully you're enjoying it. We'll have some uh, we'll have some fun on the seas today. Hopefully. Don't worry, I see the big rock. We're okay. We're gonna we're gonna stunt boat our way through here. This gap is actually like really big, and I've already forgotten where we're going, so I haven't pulled up the achievement guide thing yet. I'm gonna. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, never mind. Sorry, I got tricked. I got tricked. I mean, they're really convincing from a far off distance. They're just like. They're just freaky enough. It does look like that skeleton boat is just like spinning in circles. If the captain had a heart attack at the wheel and like pulled the thing like all the way to the left. Uh, let's see. Now we are going to look for flooded embrace. Yeah, exactly like us. We're hard. Just spinning aimlessly in circles. What do you mean? Uh oh, uh oh. Oh. All right, so we're gonna try and find five journals. That's how you make some progress. Uh, we'll see if we find any like decent like treasure and stuff like that. I can actually probably rank up to level 45 in the gold hoarders and 33 in the order of souls. At level 45, uh, I can unlock a new sort of quest, I believe. Um, I'm also pretty close on accommodation. Alright. Alright, so we're going to breeze by the crooked masts and then we will head to that, uh, that area. And we'll just let the wind take us today. No sailing against the wind today. What? We're going straight for, straight for the underwater. Well, right, but I mean, I think that the thing that we could do that would stop right next to the top right next to it perfectly. 
Uh huh. Yeah, it's like M12 or L12 or something like that. Oh yeah, that must be what it is. Because I think you had even suggested doing the underwater shrine, but I was too irritated. Oh, we do have the we do have the lightning thing off in the distance. Yeah, the big red twister. I mean, there's no telling exactly how far away that is. Okay. We're coming up on it, so. We are right at, right there. So you just like leave your boat there? Yeah, that's why I'm like never want to have I didn't even get a a crate. Oh yeah, we didn't even get a storage crate. You know that really did cut down on the amount of time that we spent before we got out on the uh on the ocean. That's always good. Can I pick this up at all? Nope. Okay. So it looks like the first one. There's like a supposed to be an air pocket somewhere on a boat that we can you can like walk around and find a thing. Oh, I think you know what? I think we've been in this area before. I don't believe I have. Said like that you could walk around. Uh, I definitely forgot. Uh, gotta find. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa! You fucking, you fucking calm down. You calm down. Oh, that's right. There's a little... Ow, 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 ow. The little things. I'm gonna fucking die. Alright, I'm trying to get to you. Oh, there's a shiny down there at the bottom. Alright, 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 alright. Come on, come on, keep going. Alright, there we go. Uh, I need to find food. I did not bring any food. Can you fucking suck shit? I fuck yeah, I died. I goddamn died. Because I didn't bring a fucking sword or any food with me. God damn it. Good. Excellent start here. Excellent start. Oh wait, what the hell? I got a blue flame. How did I get a blue flame? I so I like died underwater to the thingy things, the like mermaid or whatever. Oh, here we go. This is a place. Oh, 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 oh. 
Now that I have improved my penmanship, I can start recording the discoveries I'm- Oh my god, is that you? Yes. Jesus fucking Christ. You just showed up and it was just like part of a leg. You didn't say anything. <laughs> I've always wanted to know about, more about the merfolk, where they came from, why they do what they do for us pirates. I never thought for a single moment that I come across a whole species I have never seen nor heard before. Oh, God. From what I have discovered in the shrine of the flooded embrace, I pray we never see their like again. Okay, so this is good. We found this wherever. Oh, okay. Let's see. Got a little thing here, some ammo, barrel. There was something shiny down on the ground, I thought. I mean, I definitely saw a glint. I don't know. Ah, there it is. There's more stuff down here. Oh, a floral coral skull. That's cool. <gasps> Ooh, there's a chest down here. Where's the thing to do the thing? The thing that's like, hey, do you want me to put this on? Oh, there we go. Collect. There we go. Okay, so where are you? Because I'm just like I'm down. I swam down. Yes. Yes. I just found it. If you had asked me 30 seconds prior, I, I wouldn't have been able to answer that question like that. But I did, uh... I didn't do it. Okay, here we go. Coral. Look at this. A hoard, a hoard a large number of chests at once. One of 20. Okay. Down. I'm down. Yeah, it's over here in this, uh... Shoot, where'd he go? Uh, up over here. In this little part of a ship. There we go. I found, so far I found a coral skull. A floral coral skull. Fun to say. Uh, and I found a coral captain's chest. Ooh, your favorite. Look. Where? You, wait, look, 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 look. Look at it. All right, I'll shoot it. I'll get rid of it. I'll make sure that it doesn't harm anyone again. Also, look, it just kind of sits there. <laughs> it just, it doesn't like float or move or anything. It just hangs out. What do you mean get rid of it? Do you really mean you want me to shoot it? Out. Well, I went off when I wasn't looking at it. Ooh, I got another captain's chest. Okay. I also have another floral. Oh, I have a villainous coral skull. I, these are great. I, I really like the way these skulls look. I like the starfish on the eye socket. Probably weird to say that. Oh, there's a there's a breathing thing right, right here. Okay, so we have oh, we have the first journal. Uh, for the first journal, uh, from the first journal, exit the shipwreck, facing south. You will see another shipwreck just in front of you. So I'm underneath the shelf. The shipwreck is lying on and look up. Closed brig door. Open it up and head inside. You'll find this journal in. Okay, so we have to find a closed brig door from the bottom side, it seems. 
Let me see if I can locate the other one. Where we were. Let's see. What was it? I probably went pretty far down. Uh, hang on. So... Probably this, and then this, and then that, okay, and then up. Ooh, ooh. They were known as sirens and had a king and queen. The king was murdered by the ancients, and the queen's rage was a thing to behold. She cursed the ancients, and they became ill. I haven't been able to discover exactly what happened, but it sounds unpleasant. But even this didn't satisfy the Sea Queen. She wanted to find a way to punish those who had wronged her for all eternity. Her desire for revenge led her to explore the forbidden powers of her people, searching for the perfect punishment. 205. And then I got this seafarer's chest. I don't know if we really want to take the seafarer's chest, but I, I, it is a thing. You gotta go below. Uh -oh. Yeah, you gotta go below. Oh, I am starting to drown, so now I gotta find a thing. Shit. Okay, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. we're okay. I found a firework. Do we want this seafarer's chest at all? Do we not worry about it? I mean, it's kind of cool. Fuck. Shit. Ah, uh, shit. Well, I'm gonna fucking drown. Wait, hold on. Stay close to me. Can you pick me up? Because I'm, I'm about to drown. Oh. Well, don't you drown yourself. Okay. Oh, it doesn't matter. Never mind. I, I fucked that. Don't go out there. Don't go out there. I'm just going to die. I, could, I couldn't find him. Couldn't find a breathing thing. Journal three. From the second journal, exit the brig and swim straight down. Just below you. What? Damage the coral orb and swim past the siren window to a giant air pocket on the other side. You'll find supplies, a merfolk statue, lots of treasure, and a journal laying on some wooden debris. Thankfully, there's a video because there's like screenshots and it's like, oh, this is helpful. But at the same time, it's also kind of like there's two screenshots. Are you still alive? Yeah, come up to me. Um, I Hang on. Let me find the. I think was it right here. There. OK, so this. And then we're going to go, I think, just straight down. And I'm trying, I'm just trying to get oriented real quick so I can figure out what I'm kind of what I'm looking for. Um, we're looking for a door. I think it's this one right here that we need to damage. I think. 
I just went down. Uh, hold on, let me see. Oh, you know what? Where's that? Where's what? Uh, you just shoot it. You just shoot it? Okay, I wasn't sure if it was that thing underneath the water. Yeah. Uh, we got some, uh, we have some stuff here. Coral captain's chest. Oh, perfect. So the captain's chest will definitely take. Uh, if you want the journal, yeah, you'll want to come through. I, I don't know. Seafarer's chest. Emerald. Is that really not a thing you can grab? Oh, there it is. Mysterious coral vessel. Is I, oh, boy, I hope we're in the right spot. Damage it. And then it does that thing. Bunch of stuff. Oh, it's on the... Okay. Okay. So we want to look at this wood plank and it's right over here. Any pirate worth their salt has come across a mermaid gem or two in their time. But did you ever stop to wonder if they were more than just trinkets you can sell to the companies for gold and reputation? Yes, you find them in mermaid statues, but have you ever seen one anywhere else? Well, I have. Whoa. Spooky. All right. Let's see. Exit the room with the third journal and swim straight down. On the southwest side of the chamber, directly below the room you were just in. Oh. Okay. Alright. Uh... Laying on top of the shipwreck. So we want to go straight down and then the southwest over here. Oh, look at that. I was looking right at it. Well, that was that was pretty nice. These seemingly harmless gems have a much darker side. The Sea Queen used them to imprison those from the world above. She bonds their souls inside mermaid statues and the power of gems transformed them into something else. She called these new creatures ocean crawlers, and they were her army, a way to take the fight to the land dwellers. As well as corrupting and changing the poor souls inside, the process corrupted the gems too. Those corrupted gems became known as siren gems. Okay, and then there is a breathing thing right under that. So that's four. The fifth journal is located at the bottom of the shrine. You'll need to you'll find it on the north side by the shipwreck at the bottom of the shrine, sitting next to some bright coral plants. For reference, it is on the other side of the shipwreck opposite. Okay. So we want what? The northern side over here? I guess uh, we got a green glint over here. Uh, let's see, I see the big shiny. I think it's going to be over here. If I'm looking at this correctly. Oh, I am looking at it correctly. As I explored the shipwrecks and delved even deeper, I came to realize that a huge battle must have taken place here. Ships crashed right through the shrine, which would surely have sent the sirens into a fury. Each side must have sought to destroy the other. No sane captain would have sacrificed this many ships without a good cause. It would have taken two powerful captains to command such a battle. Who would have such, uh, who would have had such a commanding presence? Okay, so that deed is complete. The achievement unlocked, uh, and we're uh, good to go. Did you get it? Okay. Hmm. 
there were some shiny things, but I saw some green ones as well. That those are usually just the little whatevers. That's, yeah, the tide of whatever. Did you grab something from over there? Do you want to grab these things? I don't know. Well, we have 11 now. There's a breathing thing right over here. I can hear your screen. Uh, I did leave uh, like a seafarer's chest because I wasn't sure. It seems to be like the smallest kind of area. Treasure? Uh, I don't know. I mean, you're welcome to. We're welcome to look around for a treasure. I got the, I got the books and the achievement that I was like here for, and we have a few things. Like we have a couple of captain's chests and stuff, but I haven't really seen a whole lot of like. This one seems very. This area seems very vertical. Um. That was where we got the third book. Well, I had, because you were afraid to go in, I had already picked up a few things. Okay. I'll just grab this last chest that I just kind of happened to find. <laughs> so how do you collect treasure? Does one of us want to go up to the boat and then the other person like hits collect treasure? Okay, look for me. I'm right next to you. Turn around. Keep turning. Keep turning. Hi. There's a statue right over here. Do you want me to go to return the ship? It says uh, X to return the ship, return to ship, and then Y is like collect treasure. But I don't want to just throw it up there if we don't know what's going on up top. Okay. Don't drown. We are, uh, we are clear. Where does it, where does it go? Are we on top of it? What am I looking for here? I uh, there's nothing. I don't know. Tell you what, I'll go back down. Fucking goddamn it! Dude. Why did I leave myself with these two weapons? Let's get this or that. I wonder if. Hmm. I wonder if you're supposed to wait till you get to the surface to collect treasure.
I've never... I think we only did them the one time, but we were like... We were with people who knew what they were doing. Oh no, it's all down here still. So. Uh, it's all like right next to the thing. Okay, so well, we at least learned don't uh Oh, I fucking hate you. I want to You fucking stupid bitch. Come here, you fucking asshole. Come here. You fucking absolute bitch. Awesome. Very excited to fucking die down here. Immediately. Like, just immediately. Because of the fucking... Oh, good, now I'm drowning. Excellent. Fantastic. Oh, this is going just so fucking poorly. I mean, you can. I died. Oh, you fucking... Fuck off. God damn it. Thanks for respawning them. You harpooned a shark. Try and visit, add it to log, okay. Let's just do this. Come on. How many do we have? isn't anything like worth yeah okay huh. one extra death for no reason grumble 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 yes Do you like? Okay, I'm up at the top.
Wow, I can't believe I got that one on the first try. Whew, even more impressed that I got that one on the first try. <laughs> Watch that happen. Oh, that's wild. I harpooned the, I harpooned the shark too. <laughs> So we don't have that explosive barrel. None of those words were words. <laughs> Too bad we don't have the explosive barrel. Could have blown him up. Yeah, I saw, I saw that. Be one with the waves. There you go. Alright, where's that last one? There it is. I believe that's everything. I guess if I go up over here. No glints in the water. Okay. So two of six now taken care of. Um, north is Dagger Tooth Outpost. That is probably where we're going to want to go. What way are we? I didn't even look. North? Oh. Actually looking pretty okay. And we're actually going to sail with the wind? Wild. Who would have ever guessed? I would have never guessed. Looks like I might need to turn a little left. Okay. It's a little bit more to the left. Of course, the waves are kind of pushed, pushed, pushing, pushing the boat. All right. So that achievement now is gone. Right? Is that what I? Flooded Embrace. Alright. So then there's Ocean's Fortune Coral Tomb. Ancient Tears and Tribute. What's up here? Shrine of Hunger? Coral Tomb? Ah, Shrine of the Coral Tomb, that's off to the west. That's southwest? Four marked and ready to go. I don't know why. It's, I just want that band. Back. Just like that. Did you jump off? I believe this next location is actually our destination. Way to go, Sean. Wasn't even paying attention. Okay. It is. Are you getting tired already, by the way? I heard you yawning over there. Pretty early today. 
I don't know. Most of them, a couple of them are actually like kind of a far sail away. Um. Oh, whoa, holy shit. What's going on over here? There's like, for some reason, there's a bunch of barrels out. Jesus. What is going on? What button? Ah. That's like the most startling thing. Just dum 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 dum. Like fucking calm down, watch. Jeez. Yeah, that, yeah. Wild. Totally wild. Is there a chest? I grabbed that uh, thing that I just turned in. That that was on the. That was a part of the thing that we kind kind of stumbled on. I know the parking job is not great. Chest of Rage. Where's the ladder? Oh man, I picked the wrong place to park poorly. Damn it. It just it was just sitting out there. Yeah. That's wild. Whew. That was a big chunk of a uh, big chunk of level there. I got to, got a promotion. Got up to level forty five, and I got a commendation unlocked. Coral seafarer's chest sold. Nice. What? I knew it would. I. Well, I didn't see it prior to. No, I know. That's a lot better. It just sucks because the run is so far in. Like, it wouldn't be that bad if the gold hoarders were, like, on the shore. But no, they're way deep in this one. This is the one that we've... Oh, shoot. Is our ship sick by the way? I hit the thing directly and then I just jumped off the boat with a captain's chest. Oh, I mean, I hit it directly. Wow. Well, yeah, I, I don't know. Sometimes the game... Sometimes it seems like the game is pretty nice about, like... Hey, you bumped it just a little bit. We're not going to worry about it. But that one, I think, was a little too high speed. Directly into the dock. Yeah, it's just further out in the water. Oop, a little 
tiny boop. Bringing in a decent bit of coin. Only five more ranks and I'll be a pirate legend in the, uh, what's it called? Reach rank 50 in, what's it, the gold hoarders, that's what it is. And then uh, beyond that, another 25 levels for an achievement. What? Oh, yeah, that'd be nice. Treasure chest would have been real helpful. Hand in sapphire, emerald, or ruby. So, oh, siren gems. Well, I guess, are they all siren gems? No, no, they're not. Siren gems are different from the mermaid gems. Oh, those bring in, like, a good little bit of experience. Those are absolutely worth grabbing. Hold on. Emerald siren gem? Is that you? Are you lagged to the bottom? No, oh, it sounded like you just, like, jumped off and, like... Kasploosh! I mean, those fetch a pretty good price. 1500 Not bad. And a good bit of experience. Do roughly 100 more of those, and I might get to rank 46. Oh, I did not want to take a seat. Oh, did you get the good bounty skull? This one, I mean, this one's pretty good, too, the one that I have. And that's not even a joke, because it has, uh, like, blue and green, like, crystals in the top of it. And it's a very nice blue and green. Did you look at it? It's pretty good. Yeah. The coral stuff has, like, such a good color scheme to it. What's uh, left over here? Peculiar relic. Only 200? Dang. 
I mean, something else. Uh, maybe it was like a commendation I got or something. Something didn't uh, go for... Wasn't too bad. I think it was the thing I turned in wasn't uh, all that awful. Oh, five more, five more ranks, and we can get Master Gold Hoarder voyages, or I can at least. The wondrous coins are calling. Let's see quests. You know what? Just discard all of them. Gilded greetings. Oh, wait, hold on. Well, I guess since I've already bought two, might as well just buy the third one. Some commendations. Okay. So let's see where we are. We went north. Which wasn't the most helpful as far as where the other stuff is located. Shrine of the Coral Tomb isn't too far from where we are looking. Shrine of the Coral Tomb. Okay, targeted ads. I need you to fucking calm down and stop showing me that I can buy baseball cards and Master Chief helmets. On the internet, I don't need help spending money. Okay. I know you think I do, but I really don't. Uh, this one, unfortunately, is against the wind, but all of them are actually going to be against the wind because they're all to the west. So we'll go ahead and just try and get this next one going. Oh, thank you. This one, I think, is a little northwest. be just directly against the wind but that's okay that is okay where is the storm okay I mean, the other three... Oh, God, there's like... Oh, shit, there's two big boats. Sorry. My controller's batteries are low. Oh, look at this intense fight. The Lost Gold Fort? Exciting shit is happening. There's a four-star thing, and like a one... Oh, you're next to me looking at it? Uh-oh, looks like they're gonna ram. Oh, nope, never mind, just kidding. There's some... They're kissing a little bit. Yeah, it's really, really far away from us. I didn't explain it very well, but yeah, it's it's way... Uh... Well, I didn't finish my sentence. I got too excited about, about what was going on. I was like... What?
Uh, we're kind of getting some a little bit here and there. I probably should turn a little bit more to the left, to the right. These waves are pretty bad. Looking at the uh, achievement guide to find all these journals. Which helps out over here in the reputation. The bilge rats, the sunken kingdom. Whoops, I hit the wrong button. Idiot, double idiot. Two? I think this is what we're going for. No, Coral Tomb. Coral Tomb, and then that'll uh, progress us to about halfway on this one, or to exactly halfway on this one. We'll have three left. The cool thing is you just get treasure. Just kind of like, hey, swim around for a while, get some treasure, go turn it in, get some profit. Let those two boats that are nowhere near you, let them fuck around with each other, okay? Hang out. We do have this Royal Crest Fortress we could clear out if we want to get some more stuff to turn in. No. I got you. That makes sense. That's that's a good it's a good thought process. It's just cannons from the thing. It's just surprising that the computer actually, like, hit. They're like, oh, shoot, that wasn't our intention. We were just trying to taunt you. Sorry! I was going to say, probably up front, towards the front. coming up on in here? Oh, nope, actually not. Yep. I gotta turn a little bit right. I'm overcorrecting here. Am I gonna drive right by this? And by drive I mean sail. Okay, no, we're not there. I don't know why I keep thinking we're like we're closer, but not quite there yet. Some waves. Brutal. Alright, where are we going? Where's the Where's the damn thing? Oh shit. What do you mean way off track? I see it. That's why my controller wasn't rumbling. It's because the batteries, the batteries are almost dead. Mm. Of course, I'm using a controller that takes USB-C to charge it. 
Where's my other one? Oh, Lord knows I have uh, enough Xbox. Oh. I almost was like, oh, hand me that, uh, the controller that came with my Series S, the white controller that came with the Series S. It's the same problem there, Sean. Still needs USB-C, just like the one you have in your hand. So the same damn controller. All right, here we go. We're swimming. Maybe, I don't know. You did, but I don't think it's real. Alright, so here we are, down at this shrine. Um, I guess find the entrance and kind of figure it out from there. That is not the entrance. Okay, good job. Proud of myself. Swim in. Grab that. Ah, okay, I got it. Oh, shit. Ah, okay. Sliding down the long water slide. Whoa, shit. Woohoo. Woo, fun. It's like a whole thing. Wow, this is okay. Wow, this is like a, a old situation, huh? We have some stuff. Oh, I think somebody's been here recently. Maybe not. Uh, okay, so the emerald, the siren gems are totally worth taking up there. If I could find a thing for it. I'm going to swim up. I'm going to get some air. Oh, we got a message in a bottle. Cool. You found a book? Okay. Thank you. That's what I was uh, just about to look for. I've come across many strange and interesting items in my time, but none stranger and more interesting than the seashell earring. Uh, I found what I took to be a run-of-the-mill seashell in a rock pool that turned out to be an earring. How odd. I mused out loud as I inspected it more closely. The sound of my voice triggered the earring and I heard the song of the merfolk telling me to meet them, which I did. They explained everything to me and my eyes were open to the world of possibilities that awaited me deep beneath the ocean waves. Okay. All right. I set my hand up there because I thought there was going to be a couple more. No, that was the end of the chapter. What do we have over here that's glinty? Seafarer's chest, probably not worth it. Whoa. Okay. So I think this is the one, um, that is in the like Pirates of the Caribbean thing. I think you have to hit certain things in certain ways. Okay. With the thing going. Over where? Yeah. 
No, nothing. Can't get up there. Where? So where's the fucking diagram? All right, because you go over here. Lever. Oh, I didn't even see like a coral lever or anything. Huh? Alright, what are we what are we doing here? What the fuck? down here that we need to get or I don't know we need the water level to rise you do? I just sound like something was going on. like left to some red what happens if you hit that lever again Do you, want me to hit it? you can Video game, what do you want from us? Ooh, Sapphire Siren Gem? Uh, that's what I want from you. Did you find a lever down there? There is a lever down here. Basically, the video shows, like, once you have the first book, you should be able to look to your left, and there's, like, just a big open passage, apparently. Yeah, underwater. Fuck. Yeah, look to the left. There should be, it's towards that red, that red coral. That, like, there's supposed to, what the fuck are you? Hey, you know what, YouTube? I, you know what I don't need? Is when I have a video open in a window. Is half of that covered with other videos while I'm trying to watch a video. 
fucking pain in the ass. Uh, but the levers, so the levers over here, by this little kind of like horseshoe looking thing right here. But I don't know if you can use it if I already used it. But is there another? Yeah. That's what I'm wondering. Oh, there's something over here. What'd you do? my favorite when video games just make noise and they're like you figure out what's you did what's different like um i don't know you tell me follow me I fucking fell what why are you confused uh, I said I said don't follow me because I was pretty sure that I was like leaving the area and that's exactly what I did so don't go where I went because I might not be able to get back in. Oh. Yeah, I sure can't. I don't know if that works for me. No. Okay, so that didn't do anything that I wanted it to do. Um, there might be like a third lever some down somewhere down here. I th I think maybe. But I don't know where it could be. Damn it. Oh, this game is so obtuse. Like, just unnecessarily obtuse. Just to be, like, a pain in the ass. So the one... Okay. That's doing a thing. Okay, so now something's happening. A thing is, a thing is thinging. A thing. Oh, there it is. Oh, fuck you. I don't even want to deal with you. Fuck off. God, I hate these. Oh, okay. Fuck off. Hello, please. Stop. I'm gonna fucking die. Oh, 
Oh, that's not what I wanted. I don't even think I... Oh, I did actually get it. Did you die? There's ammo down all the way on the bottom. Yeah, they're a little tough. Why would you? Why would I press the space bar and want you to show me the videos again? I X'd out of it. Space means press play. You fucking annoyance. Okay, I need you to get off the whatever you're on. Because I'm tired of your shit. usually spawn very many of them so I still don't have any food okay so we're going down here into this Still looking for that book. Is there a book in here? There's supposed to be. Where's the other one? Maybe I'm not even in the right spot. Okay, I, we're not actually in the right spot. Boy, I am... God! So, what can you do? Can you not do anything with that lever that's over there? I don't know. Maybe I need to pull something up top. That seemed to be the difference. That one's down. This is, uh, kind of annoying. Oh, there's another one over here, maybe? Maybe this is the difference? Oh, did you see the glint over here? I knew of the merfolk who, uh, what pirate doesn't, but I knew nothing of their history or their culture. The earring gave me a glimpse into that world and I wanted to see more. So I started to explore. I discovered the shrines and uh, an entire underwater kingdom filled with the type of merfolk I had never seen before. All who seemed, who all seemed to be sleeping. Something about their kingdom told me I was glad they were asleep and I and as I went deeper, I started to discover the story of how they came to be. Although this new race of merfolk were created by the strength of one couple's love, this tale did not have a happy ending. I don't think that's what we are actually were looking for. Like, it's, it's one that we're looking for, yes. Now we need to go pull that up. 
Which one? The one that I'm swimming towards? Where are you? Am I looking at you? Oh, there you are. This? What? I don't, I, there's no lever over here. Okay, all right. That's fine. We still need a different passage down here to unlock. Maybe. Okay, just right at the blue chain lever. Head to the room to find the yellow gem lever. Oh, maybe it's not. Maybe I was just wrong the whole time. Or I'm just confused about where this person is. Because the, the written description says uh, above water, whereas the video clearly swimming below the water. <laughs> I'm, I'm trying to do two different things. Neither of them are going well. And it's really starting to get on my nerves. Shut the fuck up. Stop making noise unless you're actually doing something. Video game. Okay. Where's the book? Okay, it's this one over here. This one open. So I think we've actually found the books out of order, but I don't think it matters for the game. I'm gonna fucking die. God damn it. I hate you so much. Stop. God damn it. I hate those fucking things. Those sirens are such fucking pains in the ass. So we got that one, but we have one of the other ones that we don't have or already have. I didn't even get to, I didn't even get to read it, by the way. So I got fucking hit by one of the stupid fucking mermaid things. It's going to be down on the bottom. The, uh, where am I going? Yeah, they're really quick, and it's hard to fight. It's hard to fight them because they are... Like, it, you have to fight in three dimensions, which sucks. Wow, okay, cool. You are an absolute fucking turd, and I fucking hate you. Come here. Who's... Stop it. You're really strong. I don't have any fucking food. Fuck Christ. Okay. So, if where are you? Okay. Now, where 
where were we to get that other book? Because there was like a bunch of shit over there. That we like just bypassed. We did not. I put it all in the mermaid. Okay. So. What we want to do. We want to go down here and we want to look for the book that we had. The first one that you found. And then we're going to go to the left over this way. And then I was trying to get to it, but then I I got attacked and died. And right in here is the one that we're looking for. There was once an, once an ancient warrior who fell in love with the Sea Queen of the Merfolk. Their love was all-consuming, and neither could imagine their life without the other. As time went by, they began to search for a way to bridge the gap between their two worlds. The warrior met resistance from his people, and the Merfolk possessed stones that could hold uh, that could hold powerful magic and the sea queen believed it was uh, these that would bring them together the merfolk elders warned her that their kind were forbidden to use magic to turn humans into merfolk but the warrior and the sea queen believed their love was strong enough to survive the consequences for breaking the sacred rules of her people so she used a mermaid gem uh, to turn him Okay, we got, uh, we get some more treasure at all, or was there just a book back here? Book in the library, I think, is all that's back here. Alright. There's another spot that opened up that I have some treasure, treasure hanging out of. See, as you see. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. I see it. So then this one, I think, was already... I think we're going to end up with this third one, like second. I really want these gems. I know they're inconvenient because we have to run them back and forth, but. Well, if we can park it at each table and then have get to an area where there's not everything as far away, that would just be nice. But... Yeah, we'll see. We, I mean, we sailed pretty far west, so. What? Was this it? Was there, I guess there was only the chest and the gem? Did you pull the lever back there? Okay, so now what? Oh, okay. Uh, no, but it's about to, because the guy's glowing red. opening. Oh. Right, we got a bunch of shit over here. Probably gonna have those mer things back. We have a disgraced skull, a cup, Gym. I would say that the seafarers. I found the five. I read, read five. Why are you giving me spoilers here? Oh, here we 
we go. Finally. I ate a fucking coconut and they just took all the health away. Uh, though the transformation was successful, it came at a terrible cost. It unleashed a curse that robbed the queen of her uh, and her court of their song. Now, a merfolk song is so much more than a pretty tune. It is part of who they are, their soul, and their collective memory. Without their song, these merfolk became something else, something twisted and dark. The sleeping merfolk I had seen in my adventures. This new branch became known as the Sirens. The curse that tore their song from them became known as the Whispering Plague, robbing them of who they were and leaving only darkness. Uh, by the way, there's a thing over here. Ooh, ooh yes. I'm gonna be a fan of this one. Stop, stop, stop. Fuck. Okay, 13 and 20. I have a treasure chest over here. So that'll help with uh, carrying stuff back and forth. Oh, by the way, if you're over by me, the fourth book is in this area. Right by these skulls. And then the fifth one is over here as well. Up by the, the area that I'm swimming to. So we definitely got these out of order, I think. Or maybe they just picked them out of order. I don't know. As I've, ex as I've explored further into the Sunken Kingdom, it's a great name, isn't it? I'm pretty pleased with myself. Not gonna lie, I discovered more about the Sirens. Take this place, for example. I'm pretty sure it's some sort of tomb. The sirens seem to have taken death and honoring the dead very seriously. The pool in the center contains offerings to those who have passed, and there seem to have been a fair few of them. The sirens were at war with everyone, the ancients and the merfolk. The rage of the queen filled, uh, filled all her kind, and they took every opportunity to inflict pain on others, creating a kingdom from the ruins of anything they could drag down from the world above. And bam. All right, halfway there. Do you want me to take care of that uh, gunpowder barrel over there? Huh? chest no I mean there was a no nothing worth grabbing 
The only thing that was left there was a, a gunpowder barrel. And it wasn't even like a special like, oh, here's like a, a variant version of it. Oh, shit. Yes. Yes. Right behind you. Yeah. I don't know that we need it necessarily. Uh, so I'm just gonna leave it okay. You want me to go make sure the coast is clear up there? Where? Up at Are the ship? Outside? Yeah. Did you get the five books? No, where'd you say the fifth book? Fifth book is right next to the. No, 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 no. Why'd you jump over here? Okay, so the, the other one is over here then. Hell yeah, it's a good thing we came back over here. There you go. Pop them cheap moons. All right, last thing that I put in there was a, was a treasure. Or a, uh, an emerald thing. So, we'll have a bunch of those to take. I'm back up at the ship. Uh, just a skeleton ship. Still very startling to just pop up here and see that. I'm just gonna come up instead of the yeah, please don't do that. Well, wait, hold on. I scared it scared the hell out of me. I mean if we lost the ship or died or anything, I think the hopefully the guy would still be there and we just have to come back to this like this circle sort of situation. No, there's a big bug on my screen. On my monitor. Crawling up my monitor. Bug? A bug. Bug. B U G bug. Just big bug. Big bug. Both. Can be both things. Uh, well, it's getting to the top of the monitor. I don't know where it went. Well, it crawled up the top. Look, it's going to be up by the camera thing. I'm sure, that looks great on camera. Is me just pointing. There's going to be extra light on my face. Just, don't you just tap the back of your phone twice? It went like right up. Huh? It's on my... Oh. Did you get it that time? Fell on my what? Okay. Massive panic. There's late. Folks, a big scary bug. A big old bug. It wasn't that big. It was just startling. Did you see that? i wait for her to sit down before I grab this. She's not even on the harpoon yet. Well, I guess it takes a little bit. To do that. Okay. Oh boy. Um, feel free to try and grab the big stuff. You're also you're welcome to try and grab me if you want. Uh, you know what? Don't worry about it. Just grab whatever. Sorry, I was trying to be helpful.
What do you mean you're stuck? I don't know where I'm stuck on the side of the boat. Huh? I don't know, I can't. I can't drop it. I had something on my hand, so I think I dropped it on the... Well, that was, uh... Oh, you just push B. Oh, was I sitting? You, yeah, you were sitting. Oh, that me all off. Yeah, we have a lot of little stuff. Thankfully, though, I found a treasure chest. Um, I can try and I was gonna try and just like fill it up in the water. Oops. Way over that one. We have a lot of gems. So just try and take advantage of the chest. Treasure chest. Thankfully we have at least one. There's the cool coral one too. There might be one that we can't get. No, we can get it. I just gotta time it right. There it goes. Oh. Getting commendations and ranks up there. Okay. I think that's it. I just my controller died. It's just inconvenient that the controllers finally have US like a different USB cord. Uh, of course, it's a USB cord that I don't have, so that's exciting. Hopefully unplugging this doesn't screw anything up. Okay. Press A to continue. We're good. We're ready to roll. All right. One time I plugged a cord in to a PlayStation 3 and it ruined the audio. So hopefully that didn't happen just now because who fucking knows. Southeast. I believe. Wait, which was the which is the outpost that got destroyed? Golden Sands. Well, as long as Sanctuary Outpost is okay to go to, we, we should be fine. I gotta find some fucking food. I don't know, I can't. Skeleton, it's skeleton. Oh yeah, fuck that. Is there any like good food in here?
Ooh. Oh, we have two message in the bottles that we've gotten. Uh, both of them are like the clue kind that were not our not our best. Okay. Thought you were gonna help me with that. Reason the anchor. Okay, we gotta go southeast. West. Southwest. I may have pointed I may have pointed you in the wrong direction. No, it's it's fine. Uh, that was a really unfortunate turn, huh? <gasps> Good, we have two coral treasure chests. Someone picked up a coral treasure chest and didn't even realize it. Did you, did you not get that music cue? It was a big scary music cue. No, something's going on. Nope. No, I don't see anything. That's why I'm kind of panicking. Any other... Seafarers. Oh, don't pull the fucking goddamn PlayStation 2 controller. What? I know, I know, I know. I. Uh, You know what I can do? I can take a nap really quick after I put that pork on the pork on the pan. Rest up. Get my energy back. Oh, it totally takes all your sound cues away, huh? Okay. Look at all that treasure. Look at that good old treasure. I sure was going to try and take a screenshot of that, but then my big old dumb face was in the way. Hell yeah. 
How did they get that treasure, you'll ask when you click on this thumbnail? Well, join me for the newest adventure in Sea of Thieves. Oh, shit, my pork. Nailed it. Fucking nailed it. Oh, my God. Oh, by the way, where are we going? Well past where we're going. All right, cool. Yep, we sure did. Nobody was paying attention. I was cooking pork and trying to get a thumbnail. How are you? Yes. I don't know why both of us are so tense. We haven't really had any problems with other ships today. Huh? Uh, we need to go straight north. Straight north. Turn left. I got you. I got you. Go take care of your fish. Oh, nice. Whoa. That looks pretty cool. Just the sails, please. And we like, it wasn't even close. We like sailed so far past it. Are you looking at the map? Yeah, it's just like, just. I what? You're talking to me like I can see your screen. I can't. Uh oh, did you say pull it right into this rock? Uh, I think there's more stuff on the ground again. Okay, you gotta come up here and. Hey, it worked out pretty okay. Hang on. Well, getting out's gonna be trouble. Unless we call it here. This might be a good place to finish up, turn in everything and haul it apart. What? Okay, it was like, you know, I jumped off the boat because I thought I saw treasure as we were pulling in. Uh, just seaweed, so. Pretty exciting. Pretty exciting find right there. I saw that as we were coming in and I thought, hey, more treasure. What luck. What luck? More like, wow, what an idiot. What is wrong? Just, we could be closing the wrong and the book the combo and I missed it. Huh. It's uh your jump is like just not high enough. What the fuck? Oh, I'm going to take these, I'll take these treasure chests in first, and then I can come back, I can bring it back. We 
can uh, fill them up real quick and bring some stuff on in. Oh, never mind, never mind. Oh, it's the carpet, okay. I was like, what the heck is that in the bottom of the chest? Oh, it's just the carpet. got stuck again. There you. What? You wanted to what? Uh, it's under throwables, maybe? Or just unload uh, the cannonballs. I got one of each of them. One blue, one green, one red. Well, that was boring. Ooh. That one looks... Making it so hard to turn in treasure. Yeah, your jump is just not quite enough. Look at that, Renown increased to level 40. What was the thing that you had that you were excited to see how much it was? It was? Is it the, like the the coffer? Yeah. We did, uh, I mean, we're not on, you know, 100% done yet, but so far, doing pretty well as far as, uh, ranking up and stuff. Did you want to sell the coffer of antiquated coffee? Yeah. Huh? Oh, no, you can do it. Okay. Next one up. That's what you're gonna, uh, that one was garbage. It was worth 283 coins. A little, just a little. Boop. I'm 
Yeah, we're good. Wow, I just when I thought I couldn't get any less experience or renown or whatever, whatever you just sold to them. Yeah, the chest, I or something, like, the previous one that had shown, like, how it, like, grew was, like, just barely. Uh, and then I thought, wow, that's low. Couldn't get any lower, and then the uh, gold hoarders proved me wrong. Turns out it could be lower. So I think the gems, the like siren gems, those are worth it. The uh, like the seafarer chests are not worth it. Did you get a lot for that forgotten thing? I think fourteen thirty-three, maybe. I think it was the Marauder's Chest. It might have been the Captain's Chest. We're turning in a lot of crap, like, all yeah, right next to each other, so. But I don't know what number it was. Oh, okay. Just now on my screen that I sold it. Okay, that one. Oh, shoot. I don't know. <laughs> 394 or 292. Oh, I guess it was actually the same thing. Okay. I actually got quite a bit of uh i did nearly a full rank in the gold hoarders not quite but a good uh, good chunk regardless um not a whole lot for either of the others but that is okay almost 38 in the merchant alliance made a little bit of progress in the order of souls but a lot and that's because i i like to sell the uh um, the the gems to the gold hoarders because that's just the one that I prefer. Probably could be working harder on commendations. To try and get more renown. Maybe, I don't know. Oh, actually maybe selling a castaway chest would be actually worth it. <laughs> Sell two chests of a thousand grogs to the gold hoarders. Sell 120 captain's chests. Sell 90 treasure artifacts. Oh, okay. Find 15 gold hoarder treasure vaults. Yeah. Oh, interesting. Does that help? So what do you... How do you do that? How do you get, like, the ship... Represent the gold hoarders through your ship's appearance while sailing as an emissary. As emissaries fully represent the gold hoarders through your crew and your ship's appearance. Interesting. Does that stuff actually help with your... Uh... What's it called? Your rank? Completing that stuff? Items, 10 of 19? Oops. How do I... Oh, I wonder, can I buy any new items from them? Because I did rank up, so I have a new type of quest that I can take care of. Want to find gold? I can get a new shovel. Ooh. Oh my god. Oh wow. What an achievement. Five gamer score. Upgraded a trading company, company item to its maximum. Hey, look at that. Look at that. That's cool. Um...
No. No, I don't. No. No, they're good. They're good to just be gotten rid of. Um. Oh. That one's like slightly more expensive. That's that is so expensive. Sixty. Well, I guess I have it. I just, okay, so now I guess just push to rank fifty in the in the gold hoarders. And that's uh, I guess kind of the overall goal. Um, did make some progress though today, which is good news. Sunken Kingdom is a little bit more complete. Three of the six uh, areas that we need to take care of have all their books found so far. 15 of 30 have been located. The other three that we have to do, and I they should still be marked on the map, uh, just to show you, they're all kind of in a little stretch down in the southwest to the south portion of the map. Uh, there's a big old scary boat. Okay, someone went through and probably unmarked them. I thought you were done, sorry. Um, but let's see. No, I gotta. I just gotta find the achievement. We got the coral. So was it? So we have Ocean's Fortune. Right there, bam. I spent so much time lining it up perfectly. That's pretty far. That's pretty far south. Um. Tribute. Was right there. And then. Hold on, I got, hold on. Oh. I have, I got two achievements. Actually, three of them. So, Coral, and then Flooded Embrace. Flooded Embrace, and then Coral. So, Ocean's, Ocean's Fortune. Bam. Ancient, excuse me, Ancient Tears. Those are all pretty far south on the map, so maybe if we get a maybe we'll get a good location start. I mean, we're not terribly far off, but it would be quite the sail to go around that way. Um, and that will, of course, unlock the thing, uh, unlock a new quest to do with uh, the lady who's outside the tavern. So that's kind of the overarching goal at the moment. Um, unfortunately, the uh, uh, the adventure kind of sucks because it needs so many people, so I don't think we'll be able to complete that, which is unfortunate, but hey, whatever. Maybe, I guess, check and find another video for it. I'm really bummed about it. I wish that it wasn't that way because it, uh, it is bad. Um, I think we would theoretically have, I guess, one more shot. It ends a week from today, but you need to find five people, and that's... Uh, Kind of poopy. But hopefully you enjoyed today's video. Swimming around in the ocean. Hanging out. Solving some puzzles. Getting annoyed because boy does this game like to be obtuse. And uh, turning in a bunch of treasure. Just a chill, relaxed day on the Sea of Thieves. Again, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. We'll be back next Thursday with a brand new installment. Uh, right here on YouTube.com slash Rex. So please be sure to scroll down, subscribe, and ring that bell. I forgot that I actually have fireworks that I was going to let off I do I, I have fireworks I forgot about them I was gonna I was gonna let them off the best time of day to light off fireworks right now it's the open cannonball I have a fallen warrior and a reaper's blade so here's the fallen warrior That's a nice color. And then this is the Reaper's Blade. So the first one was Fallen Warrior. This one, Reaper's Blade. All right. And a couple of nice fireworks to end it off. Hey, we'll see you next week. Thank you so much for watching. Goodbye. Happy sailing.